and that off. A field of four set off in the Horse and Jockey Hotel, Grade 2 Chase, the trip two and a half miles. Fences to be jumped 12, matching strides early on. Alaho French Dynamite, followed by the other two. Still, my companions appreciate it. And the outsider of the four, Statler. Turning to head up the far side and moving on into a definite lead of a couple of lengths, Alaho. Twice first chair in the race and 21 and 22. It's followed by French Dynamite, appreciated, and Statler. On they go to the first of 12 fences. Alaho strides on by two and a half lengths to French Dynamite. Appreciated just third on the inside of Statler. Over the first. Continuing on rising ground to their first ditch. Alaho now by three lengths to French Dynamite. Appreciated and Statler. Over the second. French Dynamite spent some time in the air. Up they go to number three. Alaho and Paul Townend, followed by French Dynamite and Dad O'Keefe. Appreciated Danny Mullins, the inside, overreaching Statler and Brian Hayes. They've completed their jumping up the far side first time. The next two fences are four and five. Alaho, the leader, now by four to five lengths from French Dynamite. Runner up here last year and then appreciated in Statler. On to fences four and five across the top section of the track. Alaho, French Dynamite, just holding on a second from Appreciated. And Statler, fence on the turn into the straight. Alaho, by two and a half lengths to French Dynamite, Appreciated, and Statler. At the end of their first mile, good run to the fence in the straight, number six taking them on past the halfway stage. Still little or no changes in the order of running, making the descent from the top of the track. Alaho, followed by French Dynamite, the Black Sleeves is in between Appreciated and Statler on this side. Stacking up, coming to the fence, that'll be the last one next time. In the feature Horse and Jockey Hotel, Grade Two Chase. Alaho by a couple of lengths to French Dynamite, appreciated in Statler. So as they return to the point at which they started, finishing on the circuit coming up, Alaho and Paul Townend by a length and a half to French Dynamite and Dad O'Keefe. And then appreciated Danny Mullins, just shading the third from Statler and Brian Hayes. Less than four lengths covering them as they embark on their second and final circuit. Having passed halfway, another six fences left to jump. Alaho, the odds on favourite, by under two lengths to French Dynamite, appreciated in Statler. Heading to the fence, which was their first. It's number seven this time, and six from the finish. Inside their final mile, Alaho. Maintains a couple of lengths advantage over French Dynamite, appreciated in Statler. Screen there was French Dynamite, joined on either side by both Statler and appreciated. Fifth last fence in their final ditch, Alaho. French Dynamite just wrestling back the second from appreciated in Statler. As they head uphill to the third and last fence in the back straight, this is fourth from the finish. Alaho. French Dynamite appreciated in Statler. As they turn towards the next fence, which will be three from the finish. Alaho, Paul Townend continue to lead the field from French Dynamite, Darrow Keefe, running the rail as appreciated Danny Mullins, and right with them is Statler and Brian Hayes as they come to the third last fence. Alaho, reeled in by stable companion Statler, who's within a neck. French Dynamite, another slight mistake, and now relegated to last by Appreciated. Two left to jump. Fence on the approach to the straight last time. Alaho, good jump there, extended the lead to a couple of lengths over Statler, who's now ridden in second, has been shown the reins, and then Appreciated, leaving behind French Dynamite. It's so a Willie Mullins, one, two, three on the turn into the straight, with one fence left to jump, and the horse and jockey hotel chase 
And downhill they come to the last. It is Alaho, followed by Statler, appreciated, is next and third. Racing inside the final quarter of a mile with one fence left to jump. And out in front is Alaho and Paul Townend, increasing the advantage to four to five lengths over Statler and appreciated. And down to the final fence, it is Alaho and Paul Townend, a familiar sight, safely over the last from Statler and appreciated as Alaho returns to pole position for William Mullins and Paul Town and winning a third Horse and Jockey Hotel Great Two Chase. Effortlessly, the winner from Statler appreciated. Tailed off is French Dynamite, but we'll complete the course. And here is Paul Town and Paul Alaho back in the number one spot. Give us your verdict on that one. Yeah. Um Look, he, it was obvious for everyone to see he went plenty left everywhere. Um, was kind of looking for a bit of company, but he covered so much ground. Um, when he heard them coming, you can't hear much of the wind out there, but he felt them coming. Uh, he, he raced well for me down the hill and put it to bed quick enough and uh, a nice performance. Yeah. I know you took a positive enough view what he did in the King George at Kempton. Did he feel much and much a different horse today? Um, not really. I was happy enough with him throughout the King George to... Uh, Albeit I wasn't able to get to the front, um, but no, look, he, he still retains plenty of ability anyway, and um, I'm glad I didn't desert him today now. <laughs> <laughs> Enough ability, do you think, to make him the horse they all have to beat as he tries to win that Ryanair chase again? Um, look, it'll be interesting what way different horses go and, and things between now and then, but uh, if he turns up there in, in top form, he'll, he'll give them all a race of it anyway. Um, and I'll definitely be putting him very high on the list when I'm factoring it in. Good man. Just before we let you go, an exciting ride to look forward to later on in High Class Hero. What yeah, progressive horse. Um, does everything nicely. Um, you know, we, we'll hope, we'll see what we can do today now. We hope he's building away on every run and uh, hope he can do that again. And, you know, he's, he's done things nicely to this point. Lovely. Paul, thanks a lot. Thanks, Gary. Watch live racing now on racingtv.com.